Hmm, another monkey I see. Why don't you lay down your weapon and join me in goodness mercy? What say you? Once you pass that gate, there's no turning back! Good look around. A great pill the Black Wind Guai had gifted the wolf. Finding it would be a deserving reward for that fight. Humble One's name is Guang Mo. Should my demise come by your hands, please pass this message to my master. Searching for deity, mortals do aspire. Craving immortality, Yao Guai's surely will conspire! <laughs> Betted Elder Jincha to burn the great sage and tongue monk alive. That's these two. 
I thought they were already turned into ashes by that fire. Who would have thought they had turned into Yaoguais? Oh, thank Mitchaba! Oh, 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 finally then, the three bells sang! Disciples come, I hear travelers approaching my temple carrying new treasures! <laughs> I cannot see you, but I recognize your odor. It cannot be you. You are back? It must be you who took that Kasaya. Now give it! told me, out of sight, out of mind is a fool's task. Seeing but seeing through is what wise men do. But didn't he turn mad by what he saw too? <laughs>
for today! Fortune is no longer on your side! No one will come to your aid. All I need is to take it elsewhere and rebuild everything on you! <laughs> of the Celestial Palace! His words ring true. No matter how daring he was, he had not the nerve to harm the Great Sage. There must be someone else pulling all the strings. Exactly! And this thing is eerie! I have no idea how to make use of its power! Except to enshrine it up there! Tricking lesser Yaoguais into offerings. If you pardon me, I'll go back to Guanyin to atone for my actions and be put back on the engaging band. You will never see me out there anymore. I oh, ignore his nonsense. Go now, little monkey. Go and retrieve the great sage's relic. <laughs> <laughs> 